How do companies identify what needs to be adjusted? Companies have their own various systems, but in general, you'll see the following approaches. One, they create a checklist of common adjusting entries, which enables them to remember to accrue interest on note payable, adjust prepaid expenses for the portion used up, count inventory and make appropriate adjustments, estimate the realizable value of their accounts receivable, etc., etc., etc. So there's a big long checklist. They work through that list to make sure they don't forget to adjust any account. Because if you forget to adjust an account, that account and the related accounts will either be over or understated, thus misstating the financial statements as a whole. They can also program the adjusting entries into their computer system. For example, when they prepay for six months of insurance, they can program the computer to expense one-sixth of that prepaid insurance, which is an asset, to the insurance expense account every month. So by the end of the six-month period, the prepaid insurance expense is zero, and they will have recognized six months' worth of insurance expense. That's the easy way. If you can program your adjusting entries into your computer, that will make the adjusting entry process quite pleasant. But not all are that straightforward, so there will be additional work that needs to be done to properly adjust the accounts. Three, they review the pre-adjusted trial balance in detail, looking for additional accounts requiring adjustment. That's what we're going to focus on in this particular video, is the thought processes that you would go through as you review the pre-adjusted trial balance.